It's a message to you, rude boy. This is my estate, and this, this is our bridge. I know, it's a bit shit in it, but it's where I live. Around here, there's one motor in life. Get paid, get drunk, get off, do it all again. You do other stuff in between, go to school or whatever. It's all a bit empty. It's not what you live for. Get paid, get drunk, get off, get paid. Well, I'm not gonna lie, still working on that one, but me and the lads had the other one sorted. <laughs> Hey! My boy! Hey, Meet the boys. I know they don't know much, but they go for a laugh, you know. Wolfie's parents own the local pub. He works on which is good for us because he always nicks the couple after his shifts. That's Terry. Been mates for years. He's a proper lad with the ladies, if you get what I mean. But he's been talking to a certain girl. Amber, that's her name. She is a right looker. We all know he likes her. But anyways, this means I get Wolfie as a wingman and he couldn't pick up a shitty little friend. Amber and Terry have been this thing now, whatever it is, for almost a year now. But then... What the fuck do you mean you're pregnant? You saw me you were on the pill. I am, but it's only like 69% effective or something. <laughs> that, my friends, in case you missed it, was he? No, 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 no. no, no. <laughs> well, not a fucking baby proof, am I? Oh, and now they're in they the right now. My But anyway, back to the boys. Then there's Casey. He's always laid back. I don't know whether it's because he doesn't care that much, or that he's always high as a cat. Oh yeah, I always figure about kiddo. I don't really remember where he came from actually. I think Casey just felt sorry for him one time and he's just stuck around. And this, this is me. Anna, and some fucker, ain't I? So we hang out at this shitty bridge most days, doing fuck all. But we make the most of a little. 